For those in and around the city, there's a new way to explore Grand Rapids while supporting local businesses. It's called the GR Bucket List, and its founder, Sarah Marilyn, joins us this morning to share more about it and the launch party happening this week. Good morning to you, Sarah. How are you? Good morning. I'm very well. We're super excited to be with you this morning. Well, we're glad you're here. For those who don't know, I mean, it's a brand new business. Describe what GR Bucket List is all about. Sure, so GR Bucket List is a list of experiences you wish to accomplish during your lifetime. So we essentially provide um, new and innovative ways to bring back business into Grand Rapids and approach different businesses to create these unique experiences within West Michigan and within our community. And the inspiration for this uh, was really due to COVID-19, is that correct? Yeah, so me working as a journalist prior, um, I really saw the need for um, a way to try to launch business again back into the community, back into West Michigan. The businesses were struggling to turn the lights on. They were struggling um, to really include businesses back in West Michigan again. So for me, um, I really wanted to create an experience where, you know, this is something new. This is something innovative. Let's let's try to create business again within West Michigan. And in just a fun way also with the pandemic being lifted to just get out and about and try new things and get out of your regular routine. And now you mentioned that getting out of your comfort zone or out of your regular routine. Uh, so well, that's a good time to list off what sort of experiences we might be able to do on our bucket list. Sure, so we have workshops, classes, festival tickets, and tastings. So if you're looking to try a new class, maybe it's a charcuterie class, or maybe if you haven't been already, go on the Grand Rapids Beer Trolley and take a tour of West Michigan and the history of West Michigan. If you've never been to Holland, there's the Holland Tasting Tours. Um, those are all great business owners that are local who could use your support and, and just trying something new. And Sarah, you know, a lot of people watching this think that sounds like a lot of fun for me, but there may be some businesses out there, some business owners saying, well, oh, I'd like some of those folks to come to my place. How, how can they partner with you? Sure. So you can reach out to us through our website, which is grbucketlist.com, and we can help them actually curate these experiences within their business to really showcase and bring new clientele into their business that they maybe not have had prior. You know, this, I'm sure people are looking for a, a deal, right? I'm sure some of these are listed off at, at a good discounted rate. Um, before we get into how you will support the community in other ways, how can people get tickets for this Thursday? I want to make sure we get this. This Thursday's launch event is happening. Let's talk about that really quickly. Sure. So there's actually tickets. If you visit our Instagram page, GR Bucket List, there's tickets in the link in our bio for all of our experiences, including the launch event coming up this Thursday, July 29th. Can't wait. And that's going to be what there, 120 Ionia Avenue, grbucketlist.com for more information. Looks like a three hour event at the launch party. What can people expect at that launch party? Are ways to sign up for, for great events and, and things to do? Sure. So at the launch party, party there'll be lots of um, business owners that have partnered with us, um, such as a performance by the Grand Rapids Ballet. Um, there'll be um, charcuterie by Say Cheese GR. Um, there'll be just lots of different tastes of the experiences that you'll be able to find on our platform and kind of just giving you that mini taste of what you can expect from the GR bucket list moving forward. So if you can join us, we're very excited. It'll be lots of fun. Um, there'll be a DJ, um, definitely many performances and a night to remember. And very quickly, other ways that you're helping support the community beyond this? Sure. So all of the funds actually get reinvested back into the community. So people that can't afford social media or marketing, we actually reach out to those business owners and work with them directly to be able to really showcase their businesses that are really hidden gems within Michigan. So people reach out to us for their assistance in creating blog posts and content, and we really assist them um, in trying to really establish what Grand Rapids is really all about. Love this idea. So experiences, that's where it's at. You don't want to go and just buy products. You want to get out there and live West Michigan, right? The GR Bucket List, the launch party, July 29th, as you heard, all the information at grbucketlist.com. Sarah, thank you so much for the information this morning. Appreciate it.